Orchid in nature produce thousands and even millions of seeds per fruit. This is an adaptation of biggest family of flowering plants in the world. The chances of orchid seeds landing in suitable growing environment are very little, considering their moisture, nutrient, and mycorrhizal requirements. Out of thousands and millions, only a few survives and grow to maturity. Science has demonstrated that the mature orchid seeds may be grown in artificial media, and this is the most viable way to ensure survival of the most of the seeds. Growing the seeds in the artificial media is the most effective way orchid may be grown for conservation. Green pod technique is very commonly done by commercial orchid growers. This technique involves scraping the immature seeds from the fruit of orchids. This is very easy to do, but it involves scraping the placental mother tissue together with the seeds. If the mother plant is virus infected, there is a big chance that the seedling may carry the virus with them too. Dry seed is the best way to get virus-free seedlings. Orchid seeds may be collected when the fruit pod matures and dry up. The powdery seeds may be shaken off the dry fruits. Seeds may store in the refrigerator for several months. Mature dendrobium anosmum seed pod with yellow seeds spilling out of the cut ends of the foot. Seeds may, they may be stored in small canisters. Addition of small amount of silica gel helps dry seeds to prevent molds and bacterial infection. Five-fold volume estimated virtually of 2% Clorox or 5% hydrogen peroxide, 10 volume, added to the seeds and shaken briskly. As soon as the color shifts into lighter shade or color tone, the bleach of the hydrogen peroxide may be discarded. Bleach sterilized seed need to be washed with sterile water. Hydrogen peroxide sterilized seeds may be planted directly onto the freshly prepared media. Sterile syringe may be used to pick up the seeds from the mini canister. When the seeds start to decolorize at least 30 minutes with shaking, bleach solution 2% Clorox is discarded. A small piece of sterile cotton plug prevents the seeds from escaping into the bin. Seeds may be washed with several water prior to planting. Few drops of liquid carrying the seeds may be syringed into the medium after the sterile cotton plug is dislodged off the tip of the syringe. Two months after planting, the protocorm grows and fills up the media surface. The protocorm may then be transplanted on the third or fourth months after planting.